Welcome back everybody to the next episode of Chrono Cross. In the last episode we got us a Starkey, one of the cutest characters in the game. However, we're not using him right now and I do apologize for that. Uh, we're going to do a few things um, that are kind of side quest, not side quest, but just things that need to be done. Um, so for one, we're going to go to Earth Dragon Isle. Uh, we have a, two reasons really to come here. You gotta say, the captain told me our next exploration site would be safer without any threat of monsters, but look at this place. All you got here is a heap of sand, rocks, and all the time in the world. Perhaps there should have been more um, excitement if they joined the Marble team. So they don't know a little secret. Hey guys, that's quicksand over there. Step in there and you'll never see the light day again. Yeah, that's cool. They don't actually know what's below. What are they, crazy? I warned them too! Damn it, damn amateurs! Damn amateurs. We're an amateur, guys, sorry. Mubby. Yeah, good music, good music. So, I can never remember... Ah, which side I want to go on. And yeah, I'm, I'm pressing the run button there. I want to say it's this side, though. Yes! You, sir, I'd like to learn how to be you. Well, well, well. Well, well. Fossaker, I think it is? Fossaker, yes. Okay, so. I've learned that so long as Sprig gets the final below, they she gets their form. Like, it doesn't have to... It's not a maybe, is what I mean. Like, it just is. So, that's good to know. So basically, what we're going to do is bombs away. Yeah, we're not doing that, but, um... Yeah. God, this is a fun one. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? Um, so we can actually... Oh, we can't! I thought we could attack the bomb. Can I, um... Hit, maybe? Be great. Yeah, we're just doing this tactic where I hit with other peeps. Usually, you know, uh, links. But I'm not going to ever hit with a three because I don't want to hit too hard. Just waiting for it to sag. There we go. It is sag a lagging. Sag a lag a ding dong. That's, that was weird. Wait, what? You'll go over to him? I did not know that. Shucks. We were hoping for a kill there. Okay, come on back. That's fine. That's fine. Ish. It'll probably hurt. And we're going to do this. Yeah, got it. Wait, you're... Oh, you're still here? Bo okay. Very nice. Right, right. It's like a bomb arm from um, Final Fantasy. I do want to see. Just let's just check. Did we get it? Um. Yep, Fossaker. Very cool. Very good. So we're gonna go back over to Lynx. Um. Oh, ho, ho. This is a scary thing. Um, go for an ice blast plus one. I, I see. Oh gosh, here we go. Fun guy. I'm not sure if you're gonna die or not. To be honest, I don't know how strong these bombs are. That was a lot of damage. Like that was a significant amount of damage. Pretty darn cool. Ba -da -ba -ba. Got some mithril. Very good. More mithril. Okay. So we're here for a very specific reason, and that is to get some cogs moving. And you'll see what that is in just a moment. And great, I now have heartburn. <laughs> ah. So, what is this thing? Can't get through with this in the way. Can't we just push it? Th push this thing out of the way? 
<laughs> You're funny. Push it out of the way. The thing won't budge. I don't think the three of us can move it either. We should probably head back to the uh, up for now. There's no use staying here. So yeah, I hope you guys are excited to see Sprig throughout the playthrough because we're going to be able to become so many different monsters and that's just really fun to me. I know there's some people that aren't like fans of Sprig because of stats, but it's not all about stats. If I wanted to have a stat heavy team, I would just use like Link, Starkey, um, Radius maybe, or, or Glenn, you know, it'd be very easy to have the highest stats in the game, but not my goal. Hey, look, Toma, we showed you something. You guys all right? I thought you sure you were gone for sure. So the quicksand is the entrance and the sand boil is the, ne it's the exit. Now, why couldn't I just figure that out? There was something blocking the way, you say? Okay, let me take care of it. It may take some time, though. Let's see now. I need to assign some men to investigate and prepare explosives to move that rock. Would you mind coming back in a little while? We have some preparations to do, but thanks a lot for the help. And we now have that ball rolling. Um, I've never not come here. Because I typically come here just for the, the mithril. Uh, so I don't know what happens if you don't come here. Like, if you actually become unable to uh, get beyond that at a certain time. We got a castle. So the other um, chest down there, by the way, is another mithril. I'm not that fussed about it. We, we kind of have all the mithril we need. So, yeah, we're good. We're good for now. Ooh, someday you'll be useful. Foreshadowing. Kind of. Uh, now, so why are we coming back to this place? Well, we can actually recruit another character as well as get some stuff for good old Sprig. So we have that um, Ice Breath that we can do use. Um, I don't know if a Lava Boy is recruitable or a Hot Diggity. I'm not interested in getting a Hot Diggity, even if it is. There's a very specific monster in here that we want, and it's big, it's bad, and it's charging right for us! Well, it was for a half second, and then I was like, I'm just gonna stand here. But this is essentially the red version of the Lagoonate. It's a very powerful uh, red innate monster. The Terminator. Yeah, Taros, Terminator. Real creative stuff, I know. Hey, look, it's charging right for us. To get a plus two to attack rolls with a minus two to AC. Pathfinder D&D &D players will understand that one. Wow, that did significant damage. Did bye. Bye, bruh. I just want to be careful, because if I mean if I can get this on the first round with Sprig, that's great. Why, you know, kind of have to try again. Ah! And we'll just do weak attacks, whatever. Oh, one, two, threes. Ah oh, man. This is um Eliza. What I'm going to do is I'm actually use a blue just to kind of weaken the thing. It'll do less damage simply by putting this blue on the field. It's going to counter one of those reds on the field, and then, yeah, it's all good. Um, Just do this. And Sprigadish. Sprigalicious. I just really wish you could learn things with Sprig from her, uh, from a shapeshifted doppelganged form, you know? That would be real nice, like. And let's just charge. Oh, gosh. So, yeah, if you didn't get Inferno yet, just come snag one from this boot, this dude. Let's call him a booty instead of a buddy. Very strange choice of words for me. Um, let's also heal up just to, one, we'll get rid of the double red on the field, but also just, you know, <laughs> heal up <laughs> for the sake of healing. Really? Really? Here we go again. Here we go again on our own. Actually, if we do this, we'll have a little bit more.
Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bing, bow. Got it. Still don't know why I say that. Bada ba bum. Not sure you guys know this about me, but, um, I had another mithril. I fucking love this game. So I was about to uh, record Pokemon Rocket Edition, and then I was like, wait, I didn't record the uh, this Chrono Cross for Friday, because I had only done two for some reason my normal time. So I was like, oh, I can record Chrono Cross, and I got so happy. Oh, hey. Yeah, we're just going <laughs> to... Don't ask me why I do that. I don't know why I do the things I do. Uh, ice bread. I was like, did you not work? It made the sound. I'm gonna go this way. And be disappointed that there are no items. Did they like get rid of the items in Homeworlds version of place? I kind of want to see if a lava boy is obtainable. I also need to look up a guide of uh, from what creatures can I steal or can I trap the summons from? Because I'd like to get the summons a snap. It's so it's a sap. Yeah, well I just said a snap for the first time in my life. Deal with it. Punk. Lava rush. Okay, that's the dead sprig. Why was she so low on HP? Did we not get healed or something? Um, uh, Julius. Yeah, good job, man. Good job. Let's just. Oh no, I should have done Cure Plus because it would have been uh, blue. But whatever. I'm not that fussed in this battle. It's not going to be that difficult. The two, two, three. Or just a two, two. Oopsie. Um. Dude, Lynx, come on, bro. You can, you can hit better than that, I swear. You're allowed to. Not against the rules. Lava Breath. Like, since... Wow, that did absolutely nothing. That's kind of rad. Kind of rad. Oh, shoot. Oh, good. Good, good. All over? Ah, uh, not quite. And fall over? Yeah, we did it. We gosh done darn did it. So as I record this game, I I, I constantly look over at my OBS. Or we just get another Inferno instead of stealing it. That's great. I constantly look over at my OBS to see um, how the audio is. And like right here, audio is perfect. But during certain parts of battle or other certain music portions, it's too loud. I'm like, fuck, they didn't master this game as, as well as I would want them to. And so it's kind of unfortunate to learn that the game is, to an extent, poorly mastered. Um, and it's weird because it's such a great soundtrack that you would kind of think that it would have had a little bit more love on it. But I don't know. I don't know. And also, I will say this real quick. Um, some people might be like, oh, so why are you doing this now when you can do it later? Da, da, da. But oh, here's a fun fact. Wait. <gasps> Dead and dried already? Fuck yes! So there's that that I didn't know was here. Oh my god. Denendrite is the next material after Mithril. That means we should be able to make at least one Denendrite weapon. Oh. Um, but thing is... Hey, get out the way. Thank you. Um, when we do eventually have to come back to Fort Dragania, well, guess what? We'll already have the path there. I would love to get down there, but I don't remember how. I Actually, I might remember how. I just need to relook. Hot diggity. Yeah, I'm really not interested in unlocking the hot diggity. If it's even an unlockable for uh, Sprig. Not really sure. Not really sure. 
I wonder if the place is bugged out in this version as well. Also, crap, I don't... Oh, do I have to do the whole thing again? I think I might. Uh... <laughs> Still bugged. Lame. Okay, so... I do believe I have to redo this. Uh, because it's a different world, so we haven't actually, you know, unlocked in this one. So, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you when Fort Dragonia, because I promise you, it is exactly the same without the boss fights. Um, I will see you guys when I have completed Fort Dragonia. So, I will be right back. Alright, I have reactivated all of Fort Well, four lower areas of Fort Dragonia. I guess I haven't done white and black yet um it took a while because i did end up capturing some uh what is it or learning some forms with sprig we learned a gargoyle and we learned a cybot you know the big yellow robots that we fought in here as well as in viper manor they're freaking tough here like we're not supposed to be here yet and i'll show you proof as to why um Maybe not that we're not supposed to be here, but we sh <laughs> we got some amazing elements. So we got in the red area, we got volcano, one of the strongest red elements in the game. Only red people can use it. We got tornado for green, iceberg for blue, and thunderstorm for yellow. So we actually have a yellow person. Boom! He can use that. It's lovely. Now I sprig. Actually, my girl, you just have enough. Perfect. Boom. You're going to be all green. You're just all green. Also, I just realized nobody has strength, uh, which is a problem. Um, nobody has strength and on that I'm aware of. So we're going to do this. In fact, I wonder if I kept somebody stocked up. Never used him. I don't think I gave you anything. Oh? Harley? Oh? Never gave Sprig anything. Never gave Vaughn anything. So, I thought I had more than one. But do you remember back in Another World when we went down below and we found a bunch of eggs that weren't really working because, you know, there was no power? Well, there just might be some power here. I'm going to use this big egg. Whoa, what good sleep. Good morning. Hey, where did everybody go? My big brother? My big sister? My kid brother and my little sister. Where did they all go? Are you my mother? Really? You look more like a father to me. Will you take me to my mother and father? Yes. Yes, we will. Draggy joined your party. Draggy is one of the cutest characters in any game. He has been in my main party so many times. Also, he's usually pretty strong. Right now, he's on the same boat as uh, Fun Guy and Sprig, who, fun enough, aside for... Why is Harley one of my strongest? Um, he's a solid character. However, his ultimate tech will make you cry. Because reasons. Where is everybody? They must be around here somewhere. Rawr, rawr. <laughs> I've never not put him in my party right away either, so I've never seen this. Where are you? This is adorable. I know. Dale probably left a fort and are playing outside. But I've never seen that scene before, because like I just said, I've never not put him in my party directly because He's really good. He's a red N8 character. He uses gloves, so it's very likely you've been using someone with gloves due to how plentiful they are. Um, 
Therefore, therefore, words, you would have a good weapon. Um, so I do, I was planning to leave, but with getting all, actually, we didn't get a white one, so why would we get a black one? You know what, we're already up here. Let's go explore different, um, all the chests here, because if the trend follows, there could be a black hole here. I doubt it, to be honest, since we didn't get a white element, because white and black are considered the strongest elements, heavily due to them being your main characters throughout the game. You know, Surge and Lynx. Um, but I am curious if a black hole is here. If not, we've also been uh, picking up a lot of Denendrite. So we have a pretty solid stock of Denendrite, which is great. So as soon as we get to the outside world, I will be loading up that smith spirit to see if we can make dendrite weapons or stone weapons. Yeah, stone is stronger than mithril. I guess mithril is a type of stone and dendrite is like, um, it's kind of like their version of obsidian or orichalcum, I would say. Uh, it's a good way to look at it uh, in terms of other games. Uh, so yeah. Nostrum. Okay, I've been getting a lot of Nostrum as well. So that's fine, I guess. Yeah, chest. Are you going to be a Dendrite? Anti-black. Okay, we did not get anti any other color. So that's kind of interesting, to be honest. Honest. Oh, I thought there wasn't going to be a chest up there. Anti, okay, anti-white. And then I'm curious what that, you know, down below is. I mean, we might as well go all the way to the top just to see if we can see anything interesting in the room in which we, well, lost our body. I don't know if I've ever gone up there at this point in the game. I mean, I'm sure I have, but it's possible that I haven't. I just don't have any memory, which is enough to say, I don't know. I don't know, man. You know, I don't. So yeah, we might as well take a peek. Hopefully they made some stairs. Good, it made some stairs. Was kind of worried that I would have to go all the way around to get that chesticle once again. But yeah, so if we do end up having to come back here, <clears throat> I'll stream again, really, uh, we will have the whole thing unlocked, which is great. It means we don't have to do it later. And guess what? Stay hydrated, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna drink some water. So throughout the next couple of battles, I will show off the uh, forms that I unlocked with Sprig because they're pretty cool. Um, really, it's just two to show you because you saw the Terminator. We haven't turned into it yet, but we've um, we fought it. But you didn't see the other two enemies. Well, you saw the Cybot. You haven't seen the Gargoyle, so I got to show you that. I got to show you that because you literally just don't know what they look like. Anything to do here? Any hidden chesticles? <laughs> okay. Um. No. Okay. Like maybe the astral amulet. Maybe because shit happened. But no. Cool. Glad to know I've not been missing anything. I mean, I'm sure I've missed some stuff because I've seen a few things in the scan that I'd never seen before, such as being able to doppelganger into a wingipede. How? Fucking badass is that? Um, the answer is very, in case you were curious. The answer is very. Any road. Um, we now have... Destination. Wedding. Destin By the way, stop doing destination weddings, people. They're weird. That's the nicest way, or the most obvious way of saying... We don't really want a lot of people to show up, so we're going to make it difficult. But then hopefully that one dude like Larry shows up and you're like, fuck, we didn't actually want Larry to come. That's why we did this destination all the way in like Southeast Asia in the jungle in an uninhabited area where the locals only speak a tongue of a of, of format of Chinese that most don't even know. But fuck, he came anyways. Any road. Uh, yeah, we have a destination, and then in the next episode, we will be going to have some... What? 
yeah, let's call it fun with a question mark because it's questionable. But that's okay. So here's a fun fact. This was optional. Starkey was optional. Fun guy was optional. A lot of this shit is optional. If you don't explore and you just kind of, you know, pinpoint, uh, like you just pinpoint the main game, I guess, you can miss a lot. Hey, look, Kermit's Hideaway's not all screwed up. I can't remember if I want to go to the Island of the Damned for anything. But this is not where I was intending to go, but that's okay. Because they could still be really useful. Okay, there are... Oh, the willow wisps I always liked the crunching sound. Listen. I thought it was... I always thought it was really cool and unique that they had a, a unique sound for... Well, moving around here. There's a neat mechanic in the Island of the Damned. Isle of the Damned. Uh, we need to get the attention of a willow wisp Also, I don't know if I can transform into one, so I'll definitely have Sprig. Hey, buddy. Oh, I think you have to, like... I think this one's, like, a given. It won't move, and so you kill it, and you'll see what happens. Da -da -da. Willows are what? Red? <gasps> Deadheads, you're here too? You're super weak. That mean I can like uno shot you? Or like one round you should say? I think this song is called Gale. Hey Gale, how are the kids? Oh, they're good, Sarah, how are you? I'm fine, you know. Hanging in there. There's always that person that's just hanging in there, you know? They're just hanging in there. And I'm like, really simple way to just be negative. I mean, I get it. Sometimes shit's just hard. But, like, you know the people who are just, they're always just hanging in there. Like, all the time. And you're like, yeah. <laughs> All right, we get it. You know my... Oh, shit. I should probably get rid of a full red lineup. <laughs> Very good. I, I don't know what you're trapping. That makes me uncomfortable to use a healing spell. Is she confused? She must be. Please don't get an insta kill. Well, you fucking would. You fucking would. Wake up! Come on, put a little back up. Hans comes up for the shit up. I was um going to heal just to you know get the stuff off this thing. Hey, it healed her, I guess. That's cool. Cool. So can we turn into one? Um. Deadbeat. Cool, we did. And yeah, we also got Gurgoyle, Terminator, and Cybot. Yeah. Let's, um... Let's heal. And I want to use this over Recover All because if that happened to be the trap, I don't think it is. Like, I think enemies can only trap the same things we can, which are definitely limited. There we go. Right. Ish. Dude, stop magma bombing. It's kind of weak. Hey, got a text message. I wonder if it's from Oats. It is from Oats. She got the bad news, guys. She has to go into work tomorrow. Like, physically go into work. Which stinks. Because she's been working from home forever, which has been awesome for her. Okay, don't you dare. As a black innate, aren't I, like, more resistant? Oh, okay. It just put a status ailment on me instead. That's fine, I guess. Alright, so is that an unlockable? I, I don't even know. Find out. What is it again? A will-o-wisp? Oh, cool. We got it. So I'm going to show you the one thing you didn't see. The gargoyle. They're really weird looking. They don't look like gargoyles at all. They just look Kind of like monkeys. 
I'm gonna be honest with you. Kind of like a weird spider monkey. Like, if it makes you a little uncomfortable, it's probably being successful. Like, I, I, I don't... I just don't know what to say about that thing. It's, oh, I forgot to open, a, open up Smith Spear as well. Gargoyle. Damn it. So they're strong, which is good. Like, they were whooping my ass. Um, and they're yellow, so if we do end up getting rid of Fun Guy, it's a great thing to turn into. Or if we're fighting something strong and green and we just... Three fire bellows. All right. And we just need, like, more power than okay. So here's the trick to Isla Dam. Boom. So we want to do that to all the places. And if I recall right, you get close enough to them and they will start to home in on you. So you're homing in a bit too well. There we go. There we go. And this is how you open up these kind of these black areas. Right. Okay, 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 come on. Come on. Just want to make sure that they're right near it, because it's it's a pretty big radius, but you don't want to screw up, and I have in the past, where it just doesn't connect, and you're like, WTF, mate. Oh, I was like, did we get just one? That would have been so nice. Hey, we got Tornado. Let's check it out. Don't be a dick. Of course. You hit the one person I didn't want you to hit. To be fair, it was like a one out of three chances, so what else? Take on the other dead head. Just a soften of a wee bit. Tornado hold! Five enemies, that makes it really worthwhile. Check that out. All that wind! Lock it! Lock it! Okay. You're not healthy. So, overkill, but we also got Thunderstorm. Just, uh, that out there. You totally just watch, you know. Wow, don't need you getting confused, Links. Thunderstorm! I think we've already seen this through the means of a... Uh, doppelgang, but not quite sure. I love this. The fact I, I really love this because I'm playing a uh, a storm druid right now in Pathfinder. Well, technically I'm playing a restorer druid, so I'm healing a lot. But I'm my domain is air or is cloud, which is subdomain of air, and so I'm doing a lot of electricity based attacks, which is pretty darn dope. Oh! <gasps> Yes. Yep. Yep, we got Earthquake. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Another strong spell. It's actually weaker than Thunderstorm, but it's it's just cool to have. Honestly, I'm not a big fan of how it looks. It's kind of weird. Um because it's not an earthquake like I would expect. It's just different, but I'll show it to you. Um, if I were to name this element instead of Earthquake, I'd probably call it, like, Seismic Smash or Rock Fall. Probably Rock Fall. That would be apt. Ah! Ah! no more. This, this, this episode's almost like a... An elemental expedition. Exposition, not expedition. I mean, kind of an expedition. We'd have to go, we had to go on an expedition to get them. More like an exposition. But yeah, this is Earthquake. The Earth smashes down a lot. And I think it's weird. But I still like it. Still dig it like the pig, you know? I was like, you better hit, girl. Girl! Let me tell you what. Sorry, sometimes I still like to just listen to the music. I know I like listen to the soundtrack nearly every day of my life, but still, I like to hear it. Can we stop? I mean, hey, at least you're attacking the enemy. Good on you. Stop! Greg, kill, kill Lynx and maybe we'll be able to transform Topple Gang into a Lynx. 
Just kidding. It doesn't work that way. Imagine if it fucking did. A one should kill you. No? Oh, I meant to use a one again. Oopsie daisy. Hey, I sprained them. Don't actually know what that does to enemies. To be honest. Get off me, fun guy. Good job, Sprig. You go. Imagine if that was like a kill for her, and that was how we ended up um, uh, learning Will O Wisp through confusion. That'd be actually really funny. Like, actually, guys. By the way, what do you guys. I don't know if I asked. I promise, I'm sure I did ask. Uh, but I don't remember. And so I promise I'm not, like, just asking for compliments. But, like, what do you guys think of the new layout? Um, it's for whilst we are, are links. I know it's darker and, and just different. And it's the carapace. Really? That's what I waste my time on? Okay. Um, but I was like, oh, I'm being creative. I'm going to switch the screen side. And I'm going to make it with the evil dude who's not actually evil. Because we're not we're controlling him and we're not evil. What am I doing? Go to Smith Spirit. Can I make Denadrite stuff, or is it story locked? It's story locked. Darn. Okay, that's all right. But let me see. Do we have? Yeah, Starkey has a better weapon than the Mithril weapon, by the way. Um. Okay, so we have the best axe, and I believe we have the best thing for Sprig. So. Oh, they already all have that. Okay. How many of these do I have? I already have three, so I'm done. Okay. Done with that stuff. Really just iron? Okay. Okay. Um, but anyways, that is going to be the end of this episode, ladies and gentlemen. In the next episode, we're going to go to Marble. Uh, very excited to go to Marble. I love Marble. I think it's a beautiful place. And has one of the best damn tracks in the game. Yeah, I, like I said, I listened to this last. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for watching. Watching? Watching? Um, I'm in a great mood today, so yeah. Have a good rest of your day. I hope it is lovely. It is Friday by the time you're watching this. At the earliest, I should say. Uh, so, enjoy your weekend. You take care. But until next time, bye-bye for now.